I've been making YouTube videos since 2006. I've had some good success in my eyes. I have over 700 subscribers and more than 600,000 views altogether. Some videos that you've watched today probably got more than 600,000 views altogether. None of my videos have gone truly viral. That's okay, that's not what it's about. I have engagement on my videos, people comment, ask questions, and I uh, have found a lot of value in pursuing this path. But it's interesting. I've uh, passed all the courses, I'm a smart kid, I w was good at school, all that. But this educational offering from Jump Cut Academy 2.0 they got me to zero in on the number one thing which I think has probably kept my videos on YouTube from gaining even more notoriety or popularity or just simply having more views altogether and more subscribers altogether because I have been making these videos since 2006 so what was I doing wrong? What was I doing right? I was interested in finding out. That's why I joined the Jump Cut Academy. Right away, the instructional material exposed my greatest flaw. I didn't say it, but I already knew. What could I improve? What are some of my bad habits? Stop effing procrastinating. All throughout my education, my six years at university, I waited until the last few days before an assignment was due to accomplish most of my assignments in all my university. <laughs> I was writing 1,500 word papers, 3,000 word papers, and editing them overnight. <laughs> Didn't make sense. What good habits can I implement instead of my bad habits? That's what the Jump Cut Academy is having me question, and I'm really happy that that's happening. So I thought I'd go over my habits, my bad habits, and what I'm trying to going to do to rectify my bad habits as a new video in this time that I'm trying to improve myself and improve my way of making videos. So what could I improve? What are some of my bad habits? I haven't bought a coffee grinder yet. Have wanted to for a long time. Beans are waiting. Buy a grinder in less than 20 minutes. Ship straight to your door. This one was easy. I did it. I committed to a manual grinder, which makes the best coarse grind I've tasted in a long time. And I already had the beans. Beans are waiting. <laughs> Another habit. Sometimes I go without a coffee all day. Headache is near certain. My solution? Drink majority of my day's coffee earlier than 2 p.m. instead of later than 3 p.m. I have an X on this one, too. I have succeeded in drinking my coffee a bit earlier. I'm even going to bed a little bit earlier. Another bad habit, I haven't been going to the pool in the morning. I'm missing stretching and relaxation. My solution for this was get there within the week. Start going at least once a week. Enjoy it. I'm waiting for some paperwork from my landlord that certifies I live here. Then I can get a membership in the city parks pools, which I was on when I was last in the city, but I was out of the city for a while. But uh, yeah, that's great. I am glad that I'm going to get to focus on my health like that. Another habit. Sometimes I say yes to the less productive and less profitable jobs. When people don't respect your time and skill with reasonable pay, work less. <laughs> That's an easy solution I've come up with. <laughs> but it also means communicating with relations, business contacts that I have, and making those business relationships stronger. Mm -hmm. Another bad habit. I want to cut out toxic attitudes about my gender, orientation, and relationship style. Reduce attention for those who don't get it and or amplify stigma and discrimination. This is ongoing. 
what I want to do is speak up more for my feelings and positions on matters that others are saying stigmatized things about. So I have a bad habit. Getting an idea for a video I think is brilliant. Pondering, not producing it, sleeping. <laughs> That's not good. At least write it down. Save it. You might as well produce it. You might as well. <laughs> this is centrally related to the YouTube um, container that this exposition is going to occur in. And I've made a video on average once every one and a half months. That's not enough for a YouTube success story. Most channels I watch consistently upload once every few days, once every week. The greatest stuff I've seen on YouTube, I've often wanted that producer to do more, but they were also lazy or distracted or caught up in other activities and they didn't find the time to make more YouTube content. And I think that's why my views are going down in the last couple of years because I haven't been producing as much. So I want to change that. Another bad habit is that I want to organize my time better so I don't feel like I'm rushing around half my day. It would be great not to be stuck in a commute half of every day, but I will continue the good habit of using my calendar and I will take more days at home. <laughs> The last bad habit in my current list is that I want to spend more time writing and composing. I stated that the solution would be spend three hours a week or more doing it, silly. You're snoozing on exotic crystals. Hmm. If I write and I compose, I'm happier. So I should. That's an easy one. But procrastinating is horrible. Procrastinating drains my days away. So if I were to keep working on my habits, I'll keep going down this list until I've gone through most of it, and then I'll make another list about the same size. And I probably still have enough bad habits that I could fill up a few pages. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. If you're already a subscriber, share a favorite video or the video that caused you to subscribe and share it. Or share a video that I've made nearly at random, but watch it, leave a comment, share. And uh, you don't need to share this video, <laughs> but you can if you want. Anyone can share any video they want. That's the great thing about the internet <laughs> and about YouTube and about social media you can share your own perspective. So don't procrastinate, do that now. Subscribe below, share below, thanks. Subscribe below.